Hello guys, today we are going to talk about the button module, known as KY004. This is the module itself. So, let's get started. This module has integrated on board a button called FZ1713 and one resistor. The resistor used in this module is 10 kilo ohm and the main reason for using the resistor is to limit current circulating inside the module. In other words, to prevent the current from burning our module. Now I will show how these components are connected together. There we have the sensor itself, and of course, the resistor R1. On the right you can see how the pins of the module are connected on this board. We have in red the flow of the voltage, we have in black the flow of the ground, and of course we have in green the flow of the signal. The button FZ1713 has two states, pressed or unpressed which is his normal state and have a life cycle of 100,000 clicks. When this button is in his normal state, the voltage will stay in first two legs or pins of the button and the output signal that the module will give in normal state, it will be high. When we press the button, the voltage will pass in the other side and by consequence, changing the output signal to low. When you release the button, it will go automatically in his normal state because of the spring inside, who force the button up. The force that is needed to press the button is 180 to 230 gram. This module has three pins. The pins in this module are the ground pin with a minus sign the voltage pin in the middle and of course the pin of the signal with an S sign. So let's talk about the signal. This module gives a digital signal so we can connect the pin of the signal with any digital port of different microcontroller boards like Arduino or Raspberry Pi. That's it guys for today, if you liked the video hit that like button, if you want more videos like this one hit the subscribe button with a bell icon so you'll be notified for every video, we upload new videos every day so the only chance to see them first is of course through subscription, don't forget to check our social media and see you guys next time.